Smile and learn. That's it. Perfect. They'll be ready in no time. Hey there, I'm making some more popsicles to sell. They taste so good. I'm sure they'll sell really fast. These are ready. See? They've become solid because I've put them in the freezer. Have you ever heard of the word solidification? It's one of the changes in states of matter. There are more changes, don't worry. I'll explain all about them. You already know that matter exists in three states, solid, liquid, and gas. A change in state happens when we heat or cool matter. If we heat solid matter, it becomes a liquid. We call this process fusion. If we heat liquid matter, it becomes a gas. We call this process vaporization. These two processes can occur the other way around. This happens when we cool matter instead of applying heat. If we cool a gas, it becomes a liquid. This process is called condensation. If we freeze liquid matter, it will become a solid. This process is called solidification. Oh no, the popsicles have melted. I completely forgot about them. Do you remember how we call the change from solid to liquid? Fusion. When a solid becomes a liquid, it's called fusion. When the temperature of a solid rises, the particles that make up matter start detaching from one another and move more freely. See? Liquid turns into gas when heated. Do you remember how we call this process? When a liquid becomes gas, it's called vaporization. When a liquid is heated, the bonds among the particles that make up matter become more loose, so particles move around freely. What if I cover this pot? What do you think might happen? Water vapor cools as it reaches the lid, and its state changes from gaseous to liquid. Do you remember how we call this process? I've just told you, haven't I? The change from gaseous to liquid is called condensation. As a gas cools, the particles that make up matter start coming closer to one another and move around more slowly. This will continue to happen till matter solidifies completely. I think the popsicles I froze up earlier are just about ready. That's right, I put some popsicle molds in the freezer a while ago. The liquid in the molds must have frozen up by now. The change from liquid to solid is called... Come on, you know this! I told you before! It's called solidification! During the solidification process, the particles that make up matter lay very close to one another and move less and less. These are the changes in the states of matter. Let's recap. If we heat solid matter, it becomes a liquid. We call this process fusion. If we heat liquid matter, it becomes a gas. We call this process vaporization. These two processes can occur the other way around. That happens when we cool matter instead of applying heat. If we cool a gas, it becomes a liquid. This process is called condensation. If we freeze liquid matter, it will become a solid. This process is called solidification. Now you know all about the changes in states of matter. I hope you find what you've learned useful in class. I have to go. Look at all those people lining up for popsicles. See you around. Did you like the video? We have so many more. Subscribe by clicking on the seal. Ah, and if you want to keep watching more videos, click on the boxes.